Hi guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to create your own binomial expander using Python. Now in order to create this binomial expander we first need to download Python XY. Now we can find this link through Google so let's click on this top link over here which has appeared and let's click on this link right over here and to our top right over here we should see this download button we should click on it if we want to download Python XY now I'm going to download let me see what I'm going to download let me just find it over here I've got Windows, I'm using Windows. So I need to find Python for Windows. Must be here somewhere. Let me see. Well, haven't found Python for Windows, so I'm just going to click on this one over here. I'm going to download this one. Actually, I'll get the University of Kent one. It sounds more reliable. So let's download this. Oops, this has appeared. It's going to take a little while to download, so bear with me for one moment. So with this binomial expander, you'll be able to solve probability problems and explore, let's say, pi what's his name? Pascal's triangle a bit more deeply. Bear with me one moment as I download this. Okay, so thank you for your patience. I did manage to download this file. So now I'm going to click on this file over here and we're going to download, or sorry, execute this file and run it. Okay, so I've installed my Python, right? And when I was installing it, I just clicked on next and everything. I didn't add any extra features to it or mess with its settings. I just installed it. Now I wasn't able to show you the installation because my screen recorder crashed. But anyway, we're here right now and it's been installed. Now, in order to create this binomial expander, we, we are going to need some code. And this code can be found on Google. So let's write binomial expander Python up here code and let's see what we're going to get so this link appears over here how to make a binomial expander in Python now if we go down here we are going to get this code over here and this is the code I've used to set up or to create these binomial expansions using Python now in order to create this expansion, we need to download SymPy, okay? I'm going to download it, so I'm going to click on download up here, right? And I'm going to get the appropriate version for Windows. So let's see, can we download it? So let's click on downloads over here. And I'm going to get, let me see, let me see what we can find here. I'm going to download this one over here. Simpy 0.7.6.1, Windows 32, etc. 
This is the one I'm going to download. Let me make sure it's for Windows. Looks as though it is, definitely is for Windows. So let's download it. That was quick. And now let's install SimPy. Click next over here, click next. Let's install it. Remember, we will have to return to that page with code on it because that's the code we're going to need in order to expand these binomials. So let's click on finish over here. So we've now got SimPy. Now I'm going to go down here, okay, and type in Python Idle over here. It's a desktop app. And I'm going to click on it. Okay, so this Python shell is open, right? And we need to put code into it. So let's go back to our Chrome browser over here and let's find that code. It's over here, right? Now I have to put this code into that Python shell in order to produce my binomial expansion. Now I can actually create x plus y to the power of any number. So to the power of 5, to the power of 6, to the power of 7. Doesn't make a difference. It's going to work. So let's begin putting this code into Python. So let's write import simpy. Okay. Press enter. All right. That has worked. Now let's put this code into it. I think we could copy and paste it into this Python application. Yes, it's possible. So let's press enter now. Get the next line of code, copy and paste it into Python once again. Right. Should we get to the power four? Should we use the power four? Yeah, why not? Let's use x plus y to the power of 4. Let's expand it. Now let's get this line over here and put it into Python. I'm going to do this pretty quickly. Now let's get the formula.expand function over there and paste it into Python. Check that out x plus y to the power of 4 is x to the power of 4 plus 4x to the power of 3 times y plus 6x to the power of 2 times y to the power of 2 plus 4x times y to the power of 3 plus y to the power of 4. So this binomial over here has been expanded. Um, and you can use this binomial expansion code for probability problems and to explore Pascal's triangle. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have any comments, please leave them below. And if you need any assistance, yeah, just leave your comments below. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel if you like this video.